Good morning, everybody. <clears throat> it's Will Taylor. We're on day six of the 1,000 Sustainer Challenge, the 1,000 Sustainer Movement. And I'm just going to be really short and simple here and say what we're trying to do, what I'm trying to do for Strings Attached is take that model that has been used by radio stations, symphony orchestras, ballet companies, the model of the season subscription, and come to you and ask for your help. We've been in Austin for 15 years doing wonderful work working with people like Sean Colvin, Slade Cleves, Eliza Gilkison, up-and-coming artists. We have an amazing show this Saturday with Libby Kirkpatrick, who has flown down here to Austin. I'm putting her up in my house for a week. Um, there, you know, There's all kinds of creative things we do to make this music happen, but we're coming to you to ask for you for the, cup, for the price of a cup of coffee, starting at five bucks. You can help us sustain, help us fill the gap that we have this huge gap, just like when KUT goes on the radio, we're doing the same thing. We're saying, hey, people out there in Austin, you go support KUT, $5 a month. Would you consider supporting an organization that has been around for over 15 years, has done incredible work in the community, has helped uh, schools, children, Alzheimer's patients, uh, retirees, uh, has a beautiful series called Strings on Grass, which is donation-based. Anybody can come, regardless of their financial level. We're asking if you would donate at least $5 a month, but it's been very silent out there. I've been doing these videos, haven't heard from anybody. Actually, I have heard from some people. I've had three people sign up in six days, and we're looking for a thousand people in a year. So maybe you could go right now to the link below and become one of those five people. And that's my idea. It's really simple. We need your support to do more of what we do. And it's just, again, the cup of a co cost of a cup of coffee. I think we're doing great things. If you have a question, about what we do, you can check out willhelps.com, you can check out stringsattached.org, you can check out stringsongrass.com and see all the things that we do. And we're simply saying, just like with public radio, that um, ticket sales do not cover all the costs. So we've been doing this for 15 years and we'd like to raise it up to the next level. The next level would be, what does that mean? That means where instead of me spending eight hours a day on the business and maybe an hour a day on the music, what if I could spend eight hours a day on the Music, could you make my dream come true? I'm asking you to pay my salary as a musician, and I've put in a lot of dues in Austin, building this this organization, Strings Attached, and I'm asking you for the cup of for the cost of a cup of coffee per month, five dollars or more. Maybe you can afford more. Come on board and help me just do eight hours a day as a musician. Help me pay musicians that I. Uh, work that I employ through Strings Attached help me take it to the next level so I can do great things for the people that love the music we do in Austin. And then, secondly, I want to take all this information, everything that I learn, and share it with other musicians, share it with other artists about another way that they can make a living that's reliable, that's sustainable. All right, that's my video for today. Three minutes. <laughs> Enjoy the music after this. Enjoy my uh, comments from audience members that I've collected over the years, and please do it now. Sign up. Imagine I'm KUT or Ballet Austin, but instead of Ballet Austin or KUT, I'm an unshaven guy that's the head of Strings Attached that is also doing great things. Do I need to be in a tuxedo next time to get you guys to sign the link? <laughs> what kind of? What do I need to do? You let me know to make it happen. Okay, thanks for listening, and see you tomorrow for video number seven or wherever we are. This actually might be video number seven. Will Taylor has brought to the community the finest eclectic and integrated kinds of, of, of uh, experience for the palette of music that we have here in Austin. Uh, Will, however, inspires me with his expansive breadth and uh, the, um, the enterprise with which he brings um, strings, combined with any kind of music. Could it be Western Swing? Could it be Blues? Could it be Pop? They do it all. I've loved it all. With old Will Taylor, a good friend of mine from way back when, I followed his career with great interest and he's influenced me a lot, really. Probably my favorite thing about working with Will and the guys is, is that when you come in uh, they invite you in and they, they don't ask you to be something that you're not. Um, they let you work to your strengths. You know, Will understands my strengths and he kind of gives me 
parts that are going to help me show my, my very best. I'm John Pointer. I believe in Will, I love his work, and I would love for you to consider becoming a patron to make sure he can keep doing the work that we love. This is Susie Heath yes. with the Pavilion at Great Hills, where we've been coming for the past uh, nine months, I think, yeah. playing here for the residents. Um, tell me about the residents here. What, what are we um, looking at in terms of the... The, the, the profile for the residents okay, at this the residents, location. We yeah. have uh, assisted living and mm -hmm. uh, dementia care side. And I tell you, the, le the residents really love the good oldie songs, and that mm -hmm. is exactly what Strings Attached <laughs> can play for you. They're right. wonderful, and they play request, and the residents love it. And we always get a great crowd when they come. And now we have an extra blessing with That's the right. baby. So. Yeah. But they're great. They're really great. I would recommend them mm -hmm. to every assisted living facility or memory care unit in town. And what's different about us or, you know, why, why would they want to hire strings attached? the reason why is because you guys are younger than the people that we normally have oh. seen here. And they enjoy the youthfulness, but also the enthusiasm you have okay. for the oldies, the good songs. Okay. And that you take the time and effort to learn those songs. Nice. And how much you interact with the residents. Okay. Your interaction is wonderful. Yeah, I was about to Both ask, what you. What, you, what did you like about our performance mm -hmm. specifically? Like some things that you remember when yeah, we do our the, performances. Yeah, the first time you came, how you mm -hmm. uh, talked with the residents and uh, laughed with them and joked with them, and okay. they really appreciate somebody who recognizes them and appreciates okay. them coming and being here for the performance. Nice. And that's exactly what you guys do. You make everyone feel welcome and feel a part of the group. So Perfect. I just think it's wonderful. I think Thank you guys you. are great. Thank you, Susie. You're welcome. So uh, she's leaving uh, soon. So we had a great time working with her and seeing yes. her every time we come but I'll be up back. here. And I, wherever I go, I will have them come to my awesome. facility for sure. Okay. Thank you, Susie. You're welcome. Thanks for saying that. Absolutely. Okay, that's that'll be great.